Hi, my name is Lori Burningham. I am the piano teacher and owner of the Piano Practice in Ponte Vedra Beach, Florida. I am right by the beach and it is beautiful here. I've been asked to share some of the ways that I use Piano Maestro in my studio. I have 30 students and with the exception of the one hour private students, they come together in sets of two. One will be with me for 30 minutes at the piano and the other will have tech time or lab time or worksheets and it is often Piano Maestro. So each week we assign one scale, one rhythm, one sight reading exercise, and then the student gets to choose which song they would like to learn from Piano Maestro that week. Uh, they know how to assign themselves on the home challenge by pushing the button and they come back the next week and we check them off. This way by assigning scales, especially for the older students who sometimes get three or four scales at a time or, or arpeggios. They already know the fingering, and so they can check off by getting three stars at home, and we can avoid taking the time during a lesson to do them here. The younger students, I will review them at lessons because they have fingering needs. The way that we're going to be using Piano Maestro uh, come January is I have an incentive. You'll see on the chart behind me, that's our current incentive that ends at Christmas. And then in January, we'll be starting the Piano Maestro World Series. And what I've done is I've come up with, this will be a banner size, the same as what is behind me on the wall, so it's fairly large. And we have two teams. We have the Note Ninjas and we have the Dynamic Daredevils. Each, um, the, the students will be divided into two sets based on how they've been playing Piano Maestro or how often they've been playing Piano Maestro. So the teams should be evenly divided. They will have assignments each week. There are five innings or five weeks. They can choose that week whether they're going to do a single, a double, a triple, or a home run, and each one requires a little more. I will have their photos that I took at the beginning of the year laminated and they will move them around the bases as they progress during the five, uh, five innings. The winner of the World Series gets a pizza party and ice cream party. So the kids are getting really excited about this. I think it's getting them excited to play Piano Maestro. Some of them don't have an iPad at home. I think I have three or four out of my 30 students that do not have an iPad. And so they will be doing iPad assignments here during their lab time so that they can still get um, singles and doubles and help their team. That is how I use Piano Maestro. I absolutely love it. I recommend it to everyone. I apologize for my printer going off behind me. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you.